Welcome back. Today I will show you how to install Ventoe USB multi-boot tool. In Google, search for the Ventoe tool. Open the Ventoe tool website and go to the downloads page. Find and download the version for your computer. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our next videos. After the download is complete, go to the downloads folder and unzip the downloaded archive file. Insert your USB drive. Open the unzipped folder and run Ventoe 2 disk application. Choose your USB drive. In the options menu, you can choose the partition map to be used. MBR or GPT. Click on install, and after that, type capital yes and confirm with OK. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our next videos. Then go to File Explorer and open the Ventoe drive. Here, you can simply copy as many ISO images as you want. The only limitation is the size of the USB device. You can drag and drop the ISO images, as I will show you, or just copy and paste them into Ventoe. What I like most about Ventoe is that once created, you don't need to format the USB drive anymore. You need to only remove or add ISO images. Ventoe allows you to keep multiple bootable ISOs on a single USB drive. It achieves this by dynamically detecting and providing a menu for selecting the desired ISO during the boot process. This makes Ventoe an efficient and flexible solution for anyone dealing with multiple operating systems, live distributions, or utility tools. Ventoe is easy to use, supports a wide range of ISOs, and is actively maintained by its community. Now restart the computer. After rebooting enter boot menu. Check in your computer's manufacturer's documentation to see which button is responsible for starting the boot menu. Boot your USB flash drive. Select which ISO image you want to load in the Ventoe menu. Then press Enter. Press Enter again. Choose an option from the image you want. Then press Enter. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our next videos. This is as you can see it was really very easy to use Ventoe tool. Thanks for watching.